It's 5 a.m. and guess what day it is? It's, it's cruise, cruise day! day! this day for so long. We are finally on the road. We are heading towards Port Charleston, South Carolina to get on the beautiful Carnival Sunshine. Woo! Woo! Yeah, baby. Uh, we are super hyped. We've already made our Starbucks stop and everybody is ready to go and extra geeked. We'll see you in a little while. this cool thing in this rest stop, uh, which is a vending area that apparently they've made it so you can't steal the machine themselves. So good job, South Carolina. I'm so happy that we can't take your Aquafina machine. I broke you out of prison, buddy. <laughs> See you guys at the port. made it to Port Charleston. The CDC has recently dropped the travel advisory for cruise ships. Uh, however, the COVID policy still is that you have to wear a mask during embarkation. So we are gonna go head over there now and we'll see when we get on the ship. Hello, hello. Howdy, howdy, happy Port we're gonna turn you off for now. We'll turn it back on when we get onto the boat. See ya. Bye. Yeah. All right, guys. First steps on board the Carnival Sunshine. Yes, we're officially cruising. As soon as we get out of the terminal, we are we were allowed to take off our masks. We are officially maskless. Feels good. Hope show our faces again on the ship. I am so excited to run on the show my smile. We can't get into our room until 1.30, so until then, you can use your boarding pass for anything that you want to get before then. Like for us, a drink. That's top priority right after we do our muster station. Do your monster station right when you get on board. That way the ship doesn't have to wait for you. You can access that by pulling out your Carnival Hub app. Uh, when you're on board, you're allowed to connect to the specific app itself. And from there, you get deck plans, and they'll show you where your monster station is. So, cruise on. Thank you. So Amanda and I just finished up doing
doing our mustard drill. Uh, we're gonna go see if we can't find Tim and Bridget and get on with our crews, get some food. Done, baby. Old-fashioned where they call you and make you stand by the like boat. Oh, oh yeah, terrible. way better. So I think our only problem is figuring out what we're gonna eat for lunch. I mean, I don't think I'm gonna have a problem. I'm definitely gonna go get a guy's burger. I think that's guys what I'm feeling burgers. too is a guy's burger. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to Alito where it's gonna be sunny for the next five days. And beautiful weather. So what kind of burger did you get, Amanda? I got a plain Jane. I added some lettuce and some pickles and mayo mustard, and this is ranch, which doesn't look that ranchy to me. It doesn't look ranchy at all. So we'll see. I've never had the ranch here. I got the uh, the ringer. Normally I would get no tomato, but you know what? I decided I'm just gonna go with the flow today. And I got some cold pole mayo for my fries. I'm excited to destroy this burger. Good. Uh, fantastic, even though it had all the fixings on it that I don't normally like. Kind of powered through it because I was so hungry. They're gone. They're gone. How about you tell them about that ranch you had? The ranch was not good. <laughs> it, it wasn't even ranch, you guys. Like it was just like mayonnaise with some of the things that ranch might have in it. Timmy liked it. So we're gonna go get ourselves a drink now. Thank you. Thank you so much. Best drink right here, kiss on the lips. Don't care if there's not much alcohol in it. It's the best drink. This is probably one of the only times you'll see me not drinking an old fashioned or something with whiskey in it during the cruise. I, uh, I got a fun ship. It's always gotta be the first thing you get on the cruise ship. So we just successfully got ourselves some embarkation cheesecake and some s'mores peanut butter cake. And I'm excited to try it out. I got the Funfetti embarkation cheesecake, which you can only get on the day that you're leaving. And a little bit of the peanut butter s'mores cake. Oh, so excited. All right, so this is the back of the ship where they've got the water slides, right? So you can race, you can see who wins. The blue or the green. Yeah. That's pretty cool. You can see the whale tail in the back there. Oh, this is where you come out on the green side. You take those stairs all the way to the top. And if you don't want to race, I guess you go down on the yellow one. 
All right, for your safety, uh, you can go ahead and race. Are you tall enough? You have to be 42 inches. One rider at a time, maximum weight is 265 pounds, 42 inches tall. Can't block the end of the slide. No flotation devices. Oh, there's an aircraft carrier over there. That's really cool. All right, guys, it's trivia time again. This bridge behind me became the tallest structure in South Carolina in 2005. Wondering if anybody can name it. So we left him and Bridget for a little bit. We're gonna hang out here in the Serenity deck, which is the adult only section. Be 21 or older to get in. That's absolutely wonderful out right now. The weather's beautiful, the sun's shining. Yeah. Couldn't ask for much more. It's like, I think it's probably about 75 degrees out right now. It's beautiful, so. Much nicer than what we had yesterday at the beginning of the day, so we're happy. We'll have to show you guys this sweet waterfall that's behind us too in a little bit. Well, I think we're going to go get another drink and hang out here for a little bit. Drink number two. Blood slide. I got an old fashioned. Cheers. Cheers. All right, what's along this side of the ship? That's the, oh, the sky track, the little ropes course. Camp Ocean is right here. <laughs> this is where all the, uh, the kids are. Camp Ocean is where they get checked into during the day. Uh, so their parents can go out and have fun. Yes, everybody gets to have fun. Thank you, Camp Ocean. Oh, that felt weird. <laughs> the, yeah. the, the, the ship like moved. <laughs> Let's see if we can find Jeff and Amanda. We're on deck 10 right now. Uh, we're looking out. This is actually where um, like the DJs will hang out or sometimes the steel drum players will, will come. Um, below us, this is the Lido deck. This is where all the parties are. The party deck. <laughs> the party deck. Got the Red Frog Rum Bar over on oh, right there. The Serenity over there. That's, oh. We gotta get over there. We're gonna make our way to Serenity. Yeah. We got another 40 minutes or so until we can get into our rooms. Coming up to the Serenity area from deck 10. One flight of stairs separates the adults from the children. All right, we gotta go check out this pool. Serenity pool area. Adults only retreat pool rules. Don't vomit. <laughs> That's gonna be pretty awesome. Yeah. Well, sweet. Thank you. And it was at this moment the Cheers package paid for itself. Let me introduce you to the Booze Master. The Booze Master. The best on the west. <laughs> and you're driving that's the best part. <laughs> yes, yes it is. Thank you, Nigel. Drink number three. <laughs> Pineapple Truly. Another Buffalo Trace Old Fashioned for me. Of course. We found Tim and Bridget, they found us. Yo. Yeah. We have rum, rum punches. Rum punch. <laughs> All right, it's after 1.30, so we're headed to our room to go see if it's ready. Serenity deck was awesome. We met Nigel, who was our bartender up there, and he said he would also be willing to be our MDR server. We are in room 8331. So your room keys come in the little mail slots. <laughs> that is your mail slot on top of your room number. Yeah, it's official, we're in. So we're going to find our room right now. Everything just opened up. It's our first time ever doing an interior. So that'll be interesting. I kind of enjoy having my balcony in the mornings. We'll see how it goes. Now we head on in. Starting off with our little room tour. We got an interior room this time just to see what it's like. Normally we have a balcony, so let's just take a little tour. We have the king size bed, which we prefer. You can get it in two twins. They're usually pretty comfortable. They got the nice luggage mat so you don't mess up the bed. We'll go around this way. Nightstand on this side. 
They got your individual lights up here, which is nice. There is no outlets by the bed. Our little TV gives you all the little safety information. You finish your safety drill, your mustard drill on here. You watch that. Makes it super easy, super simple. We did have um, a case of water delivered to our room, so we have it throughout the cruise. There is some little shelves. Our mini fridge where our water will go so it's cold when we get back at night. This must be where the plug is for the refrigerator. Lighted mirror, which will be handy. We have two regular outlets, the 120s, nice little phone. You do get some water. We have the lawn closet for dresses, slacks, things like that. This one can be used at either long or short, which is nice. You can just remove this bar. So you can have double for like your t-shirts, shorts, that type of thing. You have your safe, life jackets, and I believe that's extra bedding. Here is the bathroom. It looks small, but then you turn the corner and it's a super long shower, which is nice. Normally it's just half of that and you gotta try to maneuver your body. So Tim being a tall big guy, this is gonna be real nice for us. Our little light switches for the bathroom, the main cabin, and our thermostat. There is a nice little table with a little stool if you need it and some of your beach towels. We do have the little snooze inside, so you don't have to have your room made up, which is also nice. But we like ours usually done in the morning, so in the afternoon we can just relax in a nice straightened up room. And that is our interior room, guys. We're gonna go walk around the ship, maybe go see where the casino is or the alchemy bar and a few other things. The warehouse. <laughs> yes. The punching bag is right here. Come on, Amanda. I can't. You gotta teach me how to punch. It's gonna come down and hit you now. Let's get ready to play. not intentional. I just won a GoPro uh, Hero 7. Um, I did. It's it's currently coming out of the machine. No way! Very slowly, but it is definitely coming out of the machine. Yeah! Go uh, Jeff! <laughs> that was not on purpose at all, you guys. Yeah. Oh, are we stuck though? Carnival does not want us to get our prize. He won a yeah. GoPro! First time! A what? I just want a GoPro of my first time bunch today. <laughs> yeah, we can't get it out. I can't get it out. I'm old school. What is a GoPro? <laughs> we are going to go to guest services just because I don't think we set up our card correctly for our account. We will get that fixed. Danny? Hi. Oh, Me and Amanda went to the arcade and we are going to we, we, we do the redemption for her and she chickened out and I found out I punched like a girl but I hit 666 exactly and I want to go bro. Uh, first try. That's funny. We were trying to win the MacBook Pro earlier and we were terrible. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah. Well, I'm going to get my sale and sign card like properly and we're going to go try to, you know, be, be GoPro. So she had on. So we decided to check out the Red Frog Pub. I got the rum jumper. Um, my intentions were to come here and get a fishbowl because I thought I'd get a drink that's bigger than my head. But sadly, since we got the cheers package, we're not allowed to do that. So I ended up getting a beachcomber instead. I know I'm uh, going against what I said earlier where I'd only get uh, one fun ship and then probably the rest of the cruise I'd get uh, nothing but old fashions. But He's gotta... feeling a little fruity. Just a little bit. The normal. Fruitier than normal. 
strong. Pineapple. Very strong. But it's pretty. Your hair more? Perfect. Uh, oh. I wouldn't close it off. Hmm. But it was the best grab so far. So, first impressions of the ship. Um, it's a little outdated, but it's clean. Yeah. You know? No. Oh. <laughs> Good try. Well, we didn't get an apple. Try again. We're just chilling here. We're gonna go find Tim and Bridget maybe in a little bit after we finish our drink and watch the sail away party. That's always fun. They actually do a heck of a party getting out of port. They, they definitely sent the ship off right. We are at the sail away deck party right now. We are officially cruising. Cruising, baby. Woo! We are leaving South Carolina and we are headed out to sea. Let's go check out this party. Number five, back to my trusty old fashioned. And Amanda got another kiss on the lips. We're gonna make sure we get our use of our drink packages, Cruz. Jack with a GoPro. What? How's your kiss on the lips? Delicious. How's your Long Island? Almost caught. <laughs> it's worthy. <laughs> Watching the water slide, people coming through the water slide. They're not very fast. <laughs> I think the green and blue ones are faster. I'm gonna definitely try one, just not right now, it's too cold. <laughs> <laughs> the Serenity Pool, I jumped in that before we went and got our drinks. It was freezing. <laughs> <You Ice cold. laughs> yeah. Not no. good. Yeah, no, that wasn't going on. Do not camera. recommend. <laughs> We're sailing away. Charleston in the background. Back of the ship's always the best spot to be. It's beautiful. It is. Well, we'll see you guys in a little while. I guess we're going to get changed and head to dinner with Jeff and Amanda. Bye. Now we're going to go meet up with Tim and Bridget at the Alchemy Bar and go sign up for Anytime Dining. We're going to eat in the main dining room tonight with them. Let's see how it goes. Understand. Nigel was waiting for us. Is he? Yeah, 310. I mean, he may be waiting for us, but there's a line way up here. Nigel wanted to come hang out with us tonight, or encourage us to hang out with him. Regardless, we're going to hang out. Yeah, he's going to bring us drinks. If Nigel's last name is not Thornberry, I'm going to be slightly upset. You'd probably be slightly upset. I'm probably going to be for very a couple upset. Minutes. He's probably a cool guy.
I love you, Nigel. Come on, everybody. Now, we've got over 1,000 team members here on this ship from all over the world. In fact, over 60 different countries. And I come to you all the way from Florida. <laughs> And it's between the apple pie and the cake, and the apple pie and the cake, and the apple pie and the cake. What are you going to pick? Yeah. Both of them. Exactly. Yeah, order both. Try something new. Get out of your comfort zone. If we have any vegetarians here, try a hot dog. <laughs> Watching the Welcome Aboard show. We've been up since 3.30 this morning. What a great day. We're all gonna head to bed right now. Maybe grab a snack on the way. You know, that's just how it goes. But we will see everybody tomorrow. Uh, does anybody have anything else to say? Uh, we've had way too much to drink tonight. <laughs> Thank you, Nigel. You kicked our butts. I appreciate it. It was a great vacation. Have a good night, everybody. Good night. Bye.